Hello, guys. This will be part one of a Jack and Daxter series. I have spent my life searching for the answers that my father and my father's fathers failed to find. Who were the precursors? Why did they create the vast monoliths that litter our planet? How did they harness eco, the life energy of the world? What was their purpose? And why did they vanish? I have asked the plants, but they do not remember. The plants have asked the rocks, but the rocks do not recall. Even the rocks do not recall. Every bone in my body tells me that the answers rest on the shoulders of a young boy. Oblivious to his destiny, uninterested in the search for truth, and rejecting of my guidance. And why would he want to listen to old Samus the Sage anyway? I'm only the master of Green Ego, one of the wisest men on the planet. <sighs> So it seems the answer begins not with careful research or sensible thinking. Nay, as with many of fate's mysteries, it begins with but a small act of disobedience. Hey! Uh, Jack, old green stuff told us not to come here. with anybody who strays from the village. We will attack it in due time. What are we doing here anyway, Jack? This place gives me the creeps. Stupid precursor junk! Eek! What is that dark ooze? It sure don't look friendly! <gasps> the sage yaps on about the precursors that built this place all the time! Where did they go? Why did they build this crud? Now I like precursor orbs and power cells as much as the next guy. But if you ask me, they must have been real losers. Wow! How did you do that? I think we're in trouble! Man, that stung! I told you we shouldn't have come here, and you listened! What? I'm fine. I'm fine. What in green tarnation do you two want? We, we, we was, they was, I, I was... Don't tell me. Instead of heeding my wisdom, the two of you went mucking around in the only place that I told you not to go. Misty Island. That's right! And then And Daxter, you finally took a much needed bath, but in a bathtub filled with dark eco. What, old man? Are you gonna keep yapping? Or are you gonna help me out of this mess? I'm gonna keep yapping. Because in my professional opinion, the change is an improvement. And besides, I couldn't help you if I wanted to. What? There's only one person who has studied Dark Eco long enough to have a chance at returning you to your previous form. Carl Acheron, the Sage. But he lives far to the north. Far, far to the north. Nobody has spoken to him in ages. I would teleport you there, but I can't do that either. None of the three sages that maintain the other teleporter gates have seen fit to turn their ends on for quite a while. 
The only other way north is by foot through the Fire Canyon, but its volcanic soil is hot enough to melt precursor metal. You can't just walk through it. But you could fly over it if you had a zoomer equipped with a heat shield. I just happen to be working on such a thing at this very moment. All I would need is 20 power cells to give it enough energy to withstand the canyon's heat. Isn't that right, Daddy? Yes, Kira, that might work. But where are a boy and a half going to get 20 power cells? From the villagers. Most of them have a power cell or two stashed away somewhere. And even if they aren't willing to just give them away, greasing their palms with a few precursor orbs should do the trick. And I bet there are even more of them out in the wilds just waiting for some brave adventurer to find. Well, we've got the brave adventurer, at least. Brave adventurer? You two couldn't find your way out of the village without training. Before you do anything else, you better go through the warp gate and get some practice on Geyser Rock. Uh, we won't find any more of that dark, gooey eco stuff, will we? Cause I'd hate to fall in again and turn into you! Get in there! Before I turn you both into ferns! Okay, guys. You can't that come is back a thought. Hold on. Just need to make sure of something. I didn't want any hints on. Very sorry. Can you find all four power cells on this island? Right, so prefer sword. Um something that you collect. Green eater, give you HP. Also something that you want to collect quite a bit. Power cell. Very important thing. Collect all 100 or 101 of them, and you get a secret ending. Scout flight. An easy way of getting cash up. No. This is the one I wanted you to get, remember? That will get me with power cell. Thank you very much. Lloyd Kelly's enjoying being with the city's banners manager. Regretting not joining Rivers, isn't he? Like, he's probably got a chance to join but... Well. Yeah. Well, she has enough to be to get... Can I help that? Oh my god, that's lucky. Okay. It's 50 Percurus or if you're ready. So guys, I think this first episode I just want 100 Percurus or I'll do that and then I'll end um, off and then in two days time I'll make episode two or maybe even tomorrow and I'll try and get up to like 250, 300 Percurus or and try and get some of these things done. Oh yeah, for anyone who buys this game, if you want to know how to high jump and get the cursor orbs, hold down R1, hold circle, and spin. So that's uh, circle. So, oh no, not hold down circle. So hold down L1, hold down X, and then press circle. And yeah.
The green thing just haunts me guys. Good training, boys. But that's nothing compared to the challenges that lie ahead. Ah, then no problem. We got the moves, eh, Jack? We'd love to stay in chat, Big Green, but we're uh, itching to get on with our adventures. Fine, fine. Adventure away, then. And while you're out adventuring, why don't you make yourself useful? My darn green eco-collectors are clogged up again. Head out to the far side of the beach and clear them out, why don't you? Follow the lamps, then take you right there. No. All of you. Get out of here! I can see get in. I'll move it in a sec. I'm doing a journey over there. I'm going to start I think I can do that. Because I'm decent at the game. I knew where a lot of them are. But the question is can I get 28 in like four and a half minutes? I highly doubt. And then I'll be mad posting in the morning. No, not morning. Um, afternoon. I'm about four o'clock, um, Great British Standard Time. Um, I should start uploading, fingers crossed. Just doing this. I need to get 12 more and I knew where 15 are. I'm gonna try and get this parasail. It's a bit of a guy. One, two, three to me. 
don't care how many things it is. And it just gets me, I'm always late on the timing. Yep, I've mocked it. Yeah, I've mocked that. Wait, are you going to lock Lee's or um, Cheltenham? I forgot. Wait, so you're going to shooting. So I lock Lee's going to be like your main team and Cheltenham your academy. Right, and my 100th Procurus Orb is now. Yeah, but right, I've got like two minutes, more than two minutes, to get a scout fly, which should be pretty simple. That's being my second in this location. I think. Well, yeah, just because the old game doesn't mean it's no rules. Mind you, the rules in all football are really weird. Search up Kieran Brown, um, playing football with old, with first rules. Right guys, it's really good. On YouTube. Right guys, and we'll get this fire cell and I'll end the video. Ready? No, I've not sent it to him.